Hello and hello, welcome back. I hope that you enjoyed the first part of our program. I am so excited right now to welcome our special guest who is a leading catalyst and change agent in our accessibility community, Mr. Joe Devon. Joe is the chair of the GAD Foundation and also a co-founder of Diamond. He's also the co-founder of Global Accessibility Awareness Day, celebrating its 10th year this year. Welcome to the XR Symposium, Joe. Thank you, Bill. Uh, really excited to, to be a part of this. Uh, I also want to thank Cornell Tech, uh, Verizon Media, as well as Pete for giving me the chance to speak to you today. <coughs> uh, last month, the world celebrated the 10th annual Global Accessibility Awareness Day, as you can see from my shirt. <coughs> It was really an incredible day. Uh, there were major announcements from Apple, Google, Adobe, Microsoft, Samsung, and Slack, just to name a few, and Barrier Break launched a successful COVID-19 bug bounty. We had tons of press coverage from tech outlets like CNET to more general news outlets like the Wall Street Journal. But I'm really proud to say that my GAD co-founder, Jenison Asuncion, and I made our own announcement. We launched the GAD Foundation. And one of our key focuses with the foundation is the GAD Pledge, where open source projects take the pledge to make accessibility a core value of the project. I'm really happy to say next year we're going to have a gala called the Gaddies, and I really hope to see folks like you, XR people and companies, nominated and winning. Our mission at the foundation is to disrupt the culture of technology and digital product development to include accessibility as a core requirement. And to that end, you know, one reason I really wanted to be involved in this event was because of the importance of finally launching a new technology to the mainstream, to the masses, built with accessibility in mind rather than as an afterthought. And all of you folks involved in XR Access are doing a tremendous job to help make this a reality. Accessibility, and this is a message I really want to send out to folks that are working on XR. Accessibility is about edge cases, and doing XR well is about personalization. You're recreating the physics of the world in a personal way with headset and other devices, and it's really important to, important to get that right, and that's why the edge cases are going to get you there, and any company who pays attention to accessibility at the forefront will be paid back with the very best XR tech in the world. And now we'll move to our next session, which is a plenary panel on building for all. Thanks again, everyone, for working to make XR technologies and content accessible. Take it away.